So, um, I don't know where to start. I don't know exactly what to say. Like, I am filled with so many emotions. And I don't know how to properly express them or how to even put them in order. But I think um, we will do. The way it flows, it will flow. So the good news is I won the American Lottery, GV Lottery. I'm so excited about that. Very, very much excited. God is so wonderful. I serve a marvelous God. Like everything he does is perfect god thank you god thank you thank you so are we going to the u.s i have always started making arrangements for traveling and imagine i have to pack my whole life my whole life in cameroon to the u.s sure i'm going to miss you hmm. i wish i could put you in my box like, I literally shake my bed with him all night when it's cold, I hold him tight. Yeah, that's how cold I can be. <laughs> I'm gonna miss him. <laughs> so, I'm gonna miss this equally with this. They're gonna stay here. My kid brother will occupy my room. <laughs> He's happy about that. I have to pack. And this video is mainly on how to pack what to pack how i i pack i'm relocating y'all so i've always started making some other in my room uh, i started by all my dresses i've already taken them down all my shoes i have separated them so we started with dresses shoes books and um miscellaneous every other thing that um, we didn't necessarily to go so here are the shoes i'm going with the ones i'm gonna give away or sell here they are here they are the ones i'm gonna give away or sell and for the dresses i've made them in two we have these ones that we're giving away and these ones i'm gonna manage to pack them in my suitcases to travel I have packed some things too together. These are the ones I'm gonna give away. So I have some books here that will stay here. The others are in that bag to be given away. And these ones are the ones I've put aside to go with. So um, you'll be packing along with me when I will get. Um, the suitcases to travel so i have to go online on the airline website to check the suitcases appropriate for traveling so that i will have to come and pack on in my room everything is just in a mess right now um i don't know how to start right away so i will just put things in order and get back to you you agree with me that packing is not always an easy thing, so you want to play music, to chill, you know, to calm down the atmosphere and do it with a relaxed mind. Basically, what I did was to get some of these little packaging so that I could separate my stuffs and pack them into different packagings. Like in this bag, I have my jewelries, earrings, chains. You know, when you're about to travel, you start packing like one week before it's not easy for you to really like decide on which to take and which not to take like which dress am i going with what am i not going with it's not an easy tax don't think you can do that in one day no no so here is my carry on bag you know when you want to fold your dresses make sure um, you hold them so that you economize space in your in your bag and so you carry on you don't have to put any liquids in well you just have to look at the requirements online so you will know what to put in your carry-on bag here we are two days before my actual traveling date and my suitcases are already ready now we have to go and weigh them yeah you are allowed to have a, a handbag adding to your carry-on bag 
So here I am weighing my suitcases. Another thing you should know is when you book your flight, you're given a minimum requirement of the number of luggages you're to transport and the pounds or the kilograms that it's supposed to. So you want to make sure you weigh your boxes ahead of time in order to avoid paying extra fees at the airport for an extra kilogram or extra ton on your luggages. Like here, yeah, I had extra. I think like five pounds has to be reduced from here. Oh yeah, you got that right. We have another task on packing. <laughs> we have to reduce stuff, stuff that are not very much relevant. Yes, sis, I know we had made these pre-selections ahead of time, like weeks before packing in, and we had taken out so many things, and here we are again reducing stuffs. Oh god. But of course, we have to spare that extra fee at the airport, so we have to take out stuffs and give to someone, a friend, a sister. Yeah, after that, you still have to weigh your boxes to make sure you actually meet. The requirements. We still need to put some stuff here. Did you hear that? Yeah, so that's what um, this exercise is all about. You do the back and forth until you arrive. Um, the required pounds and then you're ready for your flight. Yeah, so this is a travel day, the morning, because uh, my flight was taking off in the evening. And we're giving some little gifts to some special people. Mm. <laughs> now yeah, they are getting emotional. Oh, <laughs> it's never easy to say goodbye, you know. Hmm. It's so hard. Oh yeah, <laughs> this was the best part of the day I was traveling. Like we had an inn where all of us went together. Like my family, very close friends, we sat over snacks and we're joking, making jokes and you know, chatting and just sharing these last moments together. It was priceless, you know, it was so priceless. <laughs> Well, I don't know if you understand Pigeon English in the Cameroonian way. <laughs> we spent time just chatting, chilling until we had to start preparing to go to the airport. You know, you have to be at the airport at least two hours before the time your plane is scheduled to take off because you have a lot of checks, customary checks, um, luggage weighing and all of that. The moment had come where you saw smiling faces changing into crying faces. You know, this is always a period where there are a lot of emotions, a lot of emotions, and they are all mixed together in just one person. So you understand? <laughs> yeah, when I speak about mixed emotions, you know, here is my mom. You saw her, she was jovial just some few minutes ago. And here we are heading to the airport. You see, her mood has just changed completely. You know that emotion of a mom separating from her daughter? Yeah, it's very hard, very hard. On the other hand, my friend sister, who were there enjoying the moments together, you know. <laughs> yeah, just, just sharing our last moment before I had to take off. Here we are heading to the airport. We are entering the Yaoundé Simale International Airport. You know, we arrived and that feeling that you're about to leave, it was a different kind of feeling, you know, excited and everything mixed within. Oh yeah, let me talk about my outfit. Oh yeah, looking juicy, right? Well, the point is when you're traveling, you have to wear something that is comfortable. You know, it's a long journey and you have to wear something that you feel comfortable in and equally don't forget to take along with you um, something that will keep you warm when you're in the plane the temperatures decrease you know when you're flying high the temperatures decrease and that's how it's cold so you have to take on something that has to keep you warm not only was your girl comfortable in this two-piece outfit she was sassy fashionista girl you know what i mean <laughs> So right now, um, I spoke about the customary checks, 
checking in before you go into the plane so you have your luggages weighed and your tickets all of them checked covid vaccine so when everything is done here we are time to get into the plane the seat in front of you or stow it in the overhead bins if you're sitting in the that front row yeah. or next to an emergency exit you have a little bit more room to wiggle this was my first time taking the plane yeah and i was excited about it yes so excited <laughs> i was you know there's always a first time to everything and this was exciting i loved it i loved my journey it was good it was so so good it was swift so i got into this plane tried to make myself comfortable getting myself ready for the plane to take off and just enjoy the beautiful view <laughs> Basically, you have nothing to worry about when you're already in the plane. You have everything to entertain yourself. It's true when you get on a plane, you can't use your phone, but you have everything provided for you to entertain yourself. And I sat by the window because I love to view outside. It was so beautiful. And about your feeding, you don't have to worry. They give you breakfast. They give you lunch. They give you um, dinner. It all depends on the times you're traveling, you know, the time of the day you're traveling. So um, I traveled on transit. I left from Yaoundé to Brussels. From Brussels, we went to Chicago. And from Chicago, I went directly to the state where I'm living in, the US, Nebraska. We arrived at the airport of Brussels at 5 a.m. and the next flight was to take up at 11 a.m. for Chicago. I made sure I captured every beauty at every spot, you know. <laughs> So this was the flight from Brussels to Chicago. It was just an hour's trip and it was cool, you know, it was very cool. Mm. So here is a plane landing at Chicago. It landed at around some minutes past 12 and my next flight was to take off at 7 52 pm that same day so i had a long day to wait so we had some mcdonald's snacks while waiting so with that excitement and the long time i had to wait i was touring around the airport just um discovering you know so then um the time arrived we got into the plane from chicago to lincoln look at this beauty look at this beauty it was so beautiful this was so beautiful you know i feel like i want to travel all the time it was so good i loved it i don't know if i would say i love traveling during the day or during the night but look at this this is so beautiful we arrived lincoln at around 9 45 and your girl got home and had a welcome party oh i was so emotional you know arriving somewhere for your first time like people were there to welcome you people you barely know i was so so emotional like i thank god so much for them in my life i thank god for everybody that is there for me supports me in one way or the other i thank everybody that i know that i love me god continue to bless you and all of you who don't know me but come across this video please just like subscribe to my channel for more of these and we have more videos to celebrate together so thank you so much for watching god bless you bye bye